I've been wanting a, um, a wooden hammer for my shop so I found a piece of molding uh, this is actually the frame to a door in the um, in the wood shop that I work at what I've done is I've glued I cut it in half so I could have two sides I glued a piece of red oak in the center and I have two pieces cut out and what I'm going to do is I'm going to router this channel out right here where these lines are on both sides and I'm going to put this red oak in on both sides as a striker area I've done a lot of research on online and I haven't found a lot about how to make a wood mallet so maybe this will help um, we're gonna try uh, we're getting it so far all right this is gonna be the handle for my wooden mallet that I'm making Here's the mallet. Uh, I've got to sand the top. I've put the red oak striker heads on each side. I'm going to basically mortise and tenon it. And I'm going to be cutting um, 9 sixteenths off of each side. And then I'm going to flip it and I'm going to cut a little bit off of each side basically what I want is for it to be three quarters of an inch wide by one and three eighths long or wide basically I'm making a handle okay this has been rough cut down on my bandsaw it's been rough cut down so that now it's uh, a nice comfortable size in the hand what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it on my sander and sand it and then I'm gonna put it on my rounder and ra I mean uh, my router and round over all the edges and then I'm gonna start looking at uh, what Fostner bits I can use to help me put it in to that head okay I've rounded over all my corners I did it this way this way then I turned it up and I did it this way you know I did it the right way but I did it this way made it all nice and smooth I'm gonna uh, sand it with my my Dewalt sander then I had cut this out and it's a tight fit now you still gotta you still gotta put it in there but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in the center here and I'm gonna cut me a, a uh, cut in here and I'm gonna glue me in a wedge but I'm also gonna glue this into here so I'm going to glue a wedge into here after I get it glued into here. Well, there it is. It's got the wedge in it. I know it's a little hard to see, but it is in there. And uh, just letting it finish curing out. Uh, I'll do a final quick little sanding on it. And then I'll stain it I guess I don't know what I'll do with it I might stain it I might just leave it natural just like this but uh, I always wanted to make me a, a wooden handled ha a wooden hammer or a mallet that's pretty much it I found two pieces of, of um, uh, railing for doors at my company 
I found one piece and I cut it down into five and three quarters put me a good piece of red oak in there put me two red oak striker caps glued me up a red oak handle cut it out uh, to a good size and there it is I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please subscribe. I will have more on the way.